Hey. Brent Ramble. Uh. What's saying with y'all, man? You see me in the SRT go kart driving around, whipping around, listening to that look. You see I'm swerving. Look at that. I'm drifting around the court, watching me hit it right here. Woo! <laughs> boy, clean. Hey, nah. Hey, nah. Oh, hey, boy, can't nobody stop me. Man, let me get off the SRT Hellcat go kart before I be done got a speed and ticket or drove off the boat. I ain't gonna lie. I low key wanna drive off this boat. I can't lie. But here go the attributes right here. Um, I, it's only an 81 overall. I've been grinding my career on my other bills to get me some more VC so I can upgrade. I got like 18k right now on me. So I'm trying to get my I'm trying to get my VC up so I can upgrade this dude some more. I haven't played no my career on this dude either. Um, and everything. But yeah, make sure you hit that like button. Three likes. That's all I ask for. That's all I ask for, man. <laughs> Here go my animations that I got equipped right now. I haven't played no like I said. I haven't played no my career games. I ain't even played a part game on this player. I would show y'all the jump shot, but like I said, it's a new jump shot, and I hadn't even played on this build for real other than in the my court. So ain't no, ain't really no point in me showing y'all the jump shot just yet. When I do bring y'all some part gameplay, I will show y'all the jump shot. But look at these few clips I got in the my court. With this build, I already know this build gonna be tough. Just based off of these clips, it's gonna be able to dunk. It's, it get a 75 driving dunk at 99, so you'll be able to get, um, you'll be able to get quick drops, not quick drops. You'll be able to get front clutches and a whole bunch of other good dunk package the martin rosen dunk package luka Doncic dunk package you gonna be able to get all them dunk packages at 99 and you will you will have like an 88 three ball um 88 ball handling and everything and another thing you do not need quick chain if you got an 88 ball handling and if you got an 85 or 86 all you need is like silver quick chain and you will be able to dribble just as fast as somebody with hall of fame in the 88 ball handle that's what i, I wanted to let y'all know that too now i'm about to show y'all how to make this build i've been planning on making this build for like the past three weeks the reason i wanted to make this build is i wanted to make a guard build that wasn't a play shot or a pure playmaker as y'all know i got a slash and play make a slash and shot creator and I also have a three-point playmaker and a slash and playmaker, which are all guard builds. But I wanted to make a build with Hall of Fame shooting. I have yet to make a build with Hall of Fame shooting this year. Well, I did have a three-point playmaker beginning of the year, but I ended up deleting them. I had a three-point playmaker with Hall of Fame shooting beginning of the year. I got a three-point playmaker with gold shooting, but I ain't got one with, I ain't have, I had one with Hall of Fame shooting, but now I got this offensive threat build because I didn't want to make a play shot. I hope y'all been following along in the background because I showed y'all exactly how to make the build, by the way. You should have been paying attention. You probably were paying attention, but these are the badges I would put on once I did max out this build. So y'all can, y'all can look at this as well as like a guide to what you want to put on. First, you want to go for slithery finisher and um, limit this takeoff first in your finishing. In your shooting, you want to go for stop and pop and sniper, as y'all seen at the beginning when I showed mine what I had upgraded with my rebirth. I had Hall of Fame sniper, Hall of Fame stop and pop on. I didn't have nothing else. But I'm showing y'all alternative ways to run your shooting badges right now uh, in the background. And here go the playmaking badges. I'm about to show y'all, I think, two ways, two other ways you can run your playmaking badges. And once you hit 97 overall, you don't need to have quick chain on. Or if you got an 88 ball handling, you don't need to have quick chain on at all. So once you hit 97 or you, you just somehow obtain an 88, this on any build. If you somehow got an 88 ball handling or you got um, a 97 overall on this build, you don't have to run quick chain. Here go the finishing bat the defensive badges right here. I'm running ball stripper because I feel like a lot of centers don't run unstrippable. But yeah, that's it. I see y'all in the next one.